Hey, what's up everybody? My name is CloudShines81 here, and welcome back to Let's Play More Kingdom Hearts Final Mix here for the PlayStation 4. Now, if you guys are wondering why exactly am I wearing a beanie for this episode, well, it's because my hair recently got cut and my head is completely shaven. Like, I am not kidding. Under this beanie, I am bald and I do not want to show my hair off. I don't care how much you guys ask me to show my beautiful, beautiful, beautiful hair off. It's not there anymore. My head's completely shaven, there's nothing I can do about it, so I'm wearing a fucking beanie. So with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, today in this episode, we are going to be going ahead and we are going to be doing End of the World today, because today is the last, this is going to be the last level and the last, um, basically mission in the game to do. Obviously, after this, I'm going to do all the post-game stuff, and then we'll do the final battle. But in the meantime, we're heading to End of the World. I just finished the Hades Cup. I got everything good, so let's hope that the shits can get with the shits, and hopefully... I don't get my fucking shit fucked up because this is going to be hard. Look at the battle level compared to uh, Hollow Bastion to this. This is 1, 2, 3. Uh, this is like, I think, an 11 or 12 star location. But I hope it won't beat me. I do know what some of the Heartless are in that world, so it might be a little bit difficult. But who knows? So anyways, here we go. This, ladies and gentlemen, is also the last gummy ship level. Oh my god, my gummy ship power is like insanely high. Okay, but this, I did not level my uh, my ship up at all. Like, I've done this all default ship. But anyways, this is the last and final gummy ship level in the game. After this, there will be no more. We will not have to ever fly in this goddamn thing again. Not until Chain of Memories. God damn it, I'm so happy that we'll never have to do these boring-ass missions ever again. But hey, at least we get to see... Oh, shit. Look at the background. It's, like, all dark. We're going to, like, literally... The darkest parts, the darkest depths of the entire world. Well, then again, it is end of the world. It is like the last stage in the game, and it's the, the end of all worlds. Um, uh, and it, oh my god, it's just, it's so creepy, honestly. It, like, end of the world, what I, I know it has a generic title, but I really do like end of the world as a stage and its design because it's supposed to resemble that sense of hopelessness, that sense of nothingness. Like, throughout this whole game, we've gone through so many worlds where there's, like, happiness, there's brightness, and Hollow Bastion was a little bit dark and gloomy, but there was still resemblance of hope. But here, nope. There's nothing. There's no hope left. Like, this is the end of the line, essentially. The end of the journey. Um, and I, I just love this aesthetic, and I love... Um, the, I just love, I just love, like, just, I don't even know what I'm even trying to say. I just love that aesthetic, and I love that, you know, sense of, you know, dread that we're going to. Like, wow. I'm just happy that I won't, oh my, what are those? What the hell are those? Okay, well, these guys can shoot lasers. Oh, fuck me. God damn it. Okay. Oh my god, these things look scary, actually. Holy shit. Okay. Yeah, I, I know they're like diamond shaped and stuff like that, but God, look at them! Their yellow eyes and everything do look like little miniature heartless, honestly. Alrighty then. Okay, okay. I gotta put my serious face on because at this point, this is like, this is serious business. Everything that we've learned up to this point, we need to put it in full effect because, oh man, they're so help me. So help me gich. So help me gich. Alright. Anyways, I'm getting a little too excited. Look at this. It's like, I'm getting too excited. I gotta calm down. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. There it is. The end of the world. Holy shit. And the, the, that stuff there is actually hearts. It's all going into this, this weird cloud of pink and nothingness. So, yeah, here we go. Disembarking on the end of the world. Last and final stage of the game. Oh, first let me save because I don't want to do that gummy ship level ever again. We're done with it. We're done. What is this? Gate to the dark. Holy shit. And my characters are leveled up to the max they can be. Um, so hopefully, you know, I won't get my shit wrecked. <sighs> End of the world. A lot of people like to say that, Gorge, is that, all that's left of the world? everybody the likes to say that End of the world is like this those basically worlds will be restored if we beat Ansem, right? Like basically yeah, this beta right. world, like this unfinished level that them, the developers made. And but all these worlds I think it really helps, honestly. What's gonna happen to this place? And to us. Like it's yeah. it's supposed to resemble that, like that cold, that this emptiness, that everything. World, so maybe it'll just disappear. Huh? But no worries. Even if this place goes poof, our hearts ain't going nowhere. 
I'm sure we'll find our pals again. Yep, I just know that we will. Uh -huh. yep. Hmm. Yeah, you're right. Oh my god, the way he looked down at Patrick. I'll return this. I promise. That is if I can even live. Um, but anyways, what I really like about this level is, like, I just love this cold, hollow emptiness. I know a lot of people say that it's, like, you know, this beta, this unfinished beta level, but I think it's really supposed to deliver. Like, look at this. This looks like something straight out of, like, Earthbound or shit like that. Holy fuck. Okay. And these dark holes will come down on us. Pause. And basically, we have to fight Heartless. And the battle theme is actually, uh, the beginning song like from the tutorial uh this this toddy or uh however you pronounce it uh but yeah it's basically this is the beginning okay i meant to strike rate not ars arcane holy shit and yeah so we got invisibles we got invisibles we got you know fucking we got sh crazy shit man i should actually activate Arioga because these guys actually are pretty damn strong Thank you, Italian choir! Yeah, just keep on jamming. Keep on singing that beautiful, that beautiful Italian in my ear. Seriously, it's like, wow. <laughs> the stakes are at its highest at this point. Okay, oh, oh my god, oh my god. Stop flying around. Okay, fine, you want, you want some force? God damn it, he moved. Okay, no, 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 ah, oh, damn it. He teleported. Oh, both my teammates are dead, lovely. Lovely. I, I up their steeds to like the max and they, yet they still die. Alright. Hurricane blast away, man. Hurricane blast away. That, that, hel that helps so much. Alright. And I also love the end of the world theme in this game. Like, is. Take me! Take me, Lord! <laughs> Holy shit! Fill me with the Italian! Oh! Oh, I could fall asleep to this song. Holy shit, it is phenomenal. Yeah, this also is the beginning music. Um, the tutorial music. Uh, end of the world. Wow, end of the world is so beautiful. It's beautiful. It's beautiful music. Anyways, the really disorientating thing about this stage is just like generally the direction as to where to go. Well, that was a hole. Pause. Uh, but basically, the, the problem with this world is definitely like the... It's it's kind of hard to navigate because everything does indeed look the same. And there's no like straight pathways or anything like that. Like, it, it is kind of a little bit difficult. Okay, come on, come on. Go, go after him. God damn it. God damn it. These guys are going all around me. Pause. I don't know. Pause, maybe? I don't know. I'm a little bit in a tizzy right now. Okay, got him. Would have been nice if I, you know, freaking slide and dash there. Just saying, you know, I'm sorry. Maybe you could do that maybe once or twice. Alright. Let's get this guy. There's a Oh, shit. There's another dark one. There's another dark ball here. Oh, nice. I got a lucid crystal. That's handy. Uh, I, it is really recommended that you use gravity on, or grab a, a pretty stone. What the hell is a pretty stone? Uh, it is very recommended that you use a, um, a, uh, a, a, a Gravaga on this stage because these guys, um, they will, like, you know, it's very, very hard. Well, uh, it's, it's difficult to, um, do damage on them because they have, like, so much health. But gravity does indeed lower their health very quickly, so it is ha handy. Anyways, a beautiful stone that glistens in the sun. It has little value. Okay. So, a pretty stone basically does jack shit in this game. You can only sell it, and that's it. I could get it in the beginning of the game if I actually won the race against Riku, but I fucking didn't because, you know, Riku's a son of a bitch. Alright, then. Man, that fucking Italian... Uh, the Italian music is beautiful. God damn it. Okay. Oh, shit. Alright. So, we also face Behemoth here on... Um, Randomly, he, he randomly shows up, honestly. Obviously, not that bad because we've already faced Behemoth once in Hollow Bastion and we faced him during the, the Hades Cup. Besides, at least he'll 
allow us to get MP up faster. Because I need it. Oh, thank you, Goofy. Or you, you know, you can use MP gift too. That that does help. Alrighty then. Behemoth did take a, uh, take me a while to beat the last time. Ow. Okay, he's invincible right now. So. Where were we? Let me activate Ariogon on myself. God damn it! I didn't mean to drop. Okay. I wanted to use Ariogon on myself so I can get those extra licks of damage. God damn it! I ah oh, Sora, stop falling like a fucking asshole. Alright. God, my Arioga's not gonna be used that much. Okay. I'm doing fuck. Get, get off. I I'm, I'm doing damage. Alright, I'm doing like lots of damage. In fact, that's handy. Okay, shit. That lightning move is very hard to dodge. I don't even really know what else I can say at this point. I mean, and everything that I, we've done is it's supposed to pay off here. Right, let me just use gravity. Oh, thank you, Caster Kiraga on Goofy. It would be nice if you um, used Arioga on me, Donald. But you know, if you don't wanna, that's fine. I I'm not. Ju I'm not judging you. I ain't gonna judge ya. Ow. Activate wind on myself. Do that damage. Give me that glo- Oh shit. Oh shit. Alright. It doesn't really do too much damage anymore considering that, you know, he's already He's already low to health. He's already low enough health, so. I should just go in for the kill at this point. Okay. At some point, Donald, you'll need to kill me. Just saying. Just saying. At some point you, you might have to put a Oh sh Okay, thank you. Thank you, Donald. You saved my life. You saved my life. That was at 1 HP. That was a little scary, but hey, it's fine. There we go. Yeah, this is the shit, Sora. You use- This is the shit. Alright. He's almost dead. I'm not gonna use Arioga. I'm just gonna go in for the kill. I think we have to fight Behemoth like three more times in this stage, which is annoying. If there is one thing I don't really like about End of the World, I don't really enjoy the the unique Heartless in this world. Aside from the Angel Stars and the Invisibles, there's really not much else variety. Like, it's just Dark Balls, and you fight Behemoth like four times, and it's annoying. Alrighty then. At least he gives you a lot of rewards. Like, a lot of rewards. He's giving me money, he gave me like a, a lot of uh, MP. Uh, he gave me a mithril, obviously, if I won, which I did, because I'm good, and yeah. Oh, come on, I don't want to, ah! Well, another black hole. Alright, so here are the angel stars, cool. I, I do love the sound design on, the, uh, on these angel stars, they are, uh, it is so cool. Okay. Oh, I got them all? Sweet! That, like, never happens. Alright, he's dead. I think I might have turned. I don't think I turned off sliding dash. If I did, I'm I'm kind of a I'm kind of a doofus, honestly. If I turned off sliding dash, I don't know. Cause Sora, t it, it, like I can't really do sliding dash on command. Sora just does it randomly, and I have to hope for the best. All right, I got an elixir. Obviously, I'll use that for like end game stuff. Avengers end game stuff, obviously. Mithril shard. Yeah, I, I really hate this area because like there's invisible walls all, all, all over the place and It's very hard to navigate like I want to go over to this box yet. There's an invisible wall like nah, bitch. It's annoying All right open this It's a fucking black hole, but hey, it's fine because I need to actually I will need to kill more. Okay now he did slide and dash. I will need to kill more um, dudes because I do need more you know, I, I might as well get as much XP as I can because this level is like, this is the level. It's gonna be rough. It's gonna be really rough. Alright, fall over you. I know you have a lot of health, but hey, you, you're giving me my, my MP blocks back and I'm happy. Alright. <laughs> yeah! Man, I'm just, I've been so weak, like, oh man. I've heard Cage won uh, Sora's, um, you know, battle clips so much. Alright, one shadow, huh? One shadow. Alrighty then. Oh, he's Donald, uh, Goofy and I are still alive. Donald just got his ass up. Alrighty then. Yeah, they do, he do, at least if the black holes do come, I get the, uh, uh, 
what is it? Uh, some stuff. Like, oh, I got a defense up. I haven't even used that. Uh, I did get an AP up. I don't know who needs abilities. I don't think I need any abilities. Yeah, I... I mean, I could get Trinity Limit, but that just chews up all my, uh... MP, which is useless. And Goofy, I mean, if I gave him... I don't care. I, I might as well just hold on to it. If I could get two more AP ups, and I'll give it to Goofy, whatever. I mean... Goofy's the only one, well, I mean, I have abilities to use, but, like, you know, I don't even know which abilities to equip, because I pretty much have all of the go-to abilities. God, I hate that. I hate the navigation in this area, because it's such a bitch to figure out where you're supposed to, look, I'm walking into nothing. What the hell? Where am I supposed to go? I think I have to go up, and then I have to fucking go around or shit like that. God damn it. Where the hell am I... Man, it's so hard to tell where you're supposed to go because, there's, again, invisible walls. There's invisible walls all over the place, and I don't know where... Where's freedom? I'm walking into nothing. That, 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 that's the, the stage name. A end of the world. You walk into nothing and hope for the best. Like, I'm literally rocking the controller stick, like, left and right. Am I in a dead end? No, I'm supposed to go over here. Okay. God damn it. Okay. Uh, shit. Where the hell? Where am I going? I don't know. I'm just aimlessly walking, hoping that, like, some some direction I can figure out because I need to go on that side. God damn it. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. All right, I might as well go this way. God! Okay, uh, I'm back over here. Jesus. Okay, let me just circle around. So confused. So confused. God, where am I going? Okay, I need to go over here. Then I can go up there, I think. Yes! There we go, Jesus. It's so hard, it's so difficult to navigate. It's so difficult to navigate. Ah, oh, another one of these. Okay, Angel Stars. Angel Stars! There's an invisible right there. God damn it. All right, you wanna be gravitated? I'll give you some force. All right. Are my teammates really dead? Okay, Donald's dead. Goofy is at least still alive. Okay, shit. Uh, what the hell? What the hell? Come here, come here. Use, use gravity, use gravity. Okay, I got, I got, oh shit. What the fuck? Okay. Yeah, there we go. Now I got max AP, so I might use that AP up on myself when I get the chance. When I get out of this battle, of course. Jeez. Gravity. Ravaga. Ravaga's so helpful. Oh fuck, ow. Wait. No! Fu no! Both of you are doing it! You asshole! Okay, good. They're okay, never mind. You assholes! Okay, there we go. And then. Oh, shit. Never actually. Uh, I, 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 he rarely does that move. Those invisibles rarely do that. Okay, you're giving him an MP gift. That's fine, Goofy. I mean, I don't need it. I don't need MP. I already got, like. Actually, maybe I do need MP. Ah, I got four blocks. That's enough. Okay, but I did, uh, up my steez on my, uh, on Sora. Sora got two, so I could get Sonic Blade, but I don't know. Sonic Blade's not helpful. Ah! I don't have any critical pluses, so I probably should equip that, because that does actually raise, um, my chances as to doing more critical hits. Where, uh, I could hit critical hits, which will be lucky. That would be helpful. And of course, I got a cottage. I'm never gonna use a cottage though, because cottages are pointless. Maybe like uh, in the beginning of the game, I probably should have, but I didn't. Because I'm that good. Because I'm a boss. Already then. What now? Oh boy. Yeah, just go after this freaking. I always go after the angel stars first, because they're, the uh, they're the more annoying ones. Ding, ding. Okay, hold on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes. Yes. Inhale. Inhale. Fuck. God damn it. Alright. Ow. Stop hitting me. Oh shit. These guys are uh, kicking my ass pretty good. Not really because I haven't died yet. I don't know if I will die. Wow Goofy. You're the MVP right now. I don't know if I will die on uh, End of the World or not. Um. If I do, well, shit, but I don't know. I got a Gale. A Gale is basically a rare, uh, it is a rare, uh, what is it, synthesis item. 
Uh, I don't know why they're called gales. Like, what the hell? A howling g g a gale frozen in crystal form. What the hell is a gale? What, what the hell is a gale, honestly? I don't know what the... What, somebody tell me what a gale is. I don't know, even know what a gale is. All right, then. We need to fight one more time in this area. And it's Behemoth again, except he has more health. So that kind of sucks. The last one didn't have too much health. Oh, thanks, Donald. That, your graphic got missed, Donald. Oh, yes. Thank you, Donald. Okay. I don't... You're gonna give Goofy Arioga. I need it more. I mean, yeah, Goofy is hitting him at least. But I do need Arioga more. Ow. Yeah, just go ahead and heal Goofy, I guess. Oh boy, oh boy. Watch out, watch out. Ow! What the hell? Yeah, I don't wanna heal. Not yet. Maybe when Donald wakes his ass up, I might heal. And again, I have second chance. I have second chance. So, you know, I don't need to heal yet. Oh, ah, damn it. I thought I was going to get away with no, no damage on the lightning, but apparently I did. Uh, fuck. God. No! Come on. What the? Where the hell am I? Okay, use gravity. That'll be the last time I use that. Because he... That... Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Thank you. Thank you, Donald. I didn't, I didn't have to waste the cure on myself. I only have one block left. I only have one block left. I might use, like, I might break Kingdom Hearts, like, rules, and I might actually use a cottage. Uh, just because of the fact that, you know... Uh, like, I could basically get all my HP and MP back from the menu. Gravigo's not gonna be helpful, Donald. Not when he has low health. Shut up! Okay, where the f Whoa, hey, ow. That's not fair. I didn't know where I was. I spawned in a little bit late. Alright. Okay, I think we're gonna get him on this one. I, I think, yeah, we're gonna get him. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Oh, boy, he gave me a mithril shard. That's handy. He also gave me all these goodies. I don't really need money anymore. Like, I have so much money that I just don't need it anymore. Anyways, with the hole, we basically now... Pause. With the hole, we basically now teleported into this room. Which, again, it looks like an unfinished room. I wonder where that handsome failure went. Dive into the most dangerous place and uh, find him. So, yeah, we're... Ba oh, I got full health. Never mind. I don't need to use a cottage. And I have enough blocks, too. Yeah, but look at this. This is a deep-ass, uh... This is like a deep-ass crevasse. Cre crevice. I think that's how you pronounce it. Crevice or crevasse? How do you guys pronounce it? I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce shit. Oh, fuck. God damn. Okay, wait, 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 wait. I know you can get up in the higher levels, so I'm gonna probably try to do that. Because there are chests up there, which I... I would like to get. I just don't know how. I don't know how. Hold on. I don't think I'm gonna make that. Maybe I can. Wait, maybe? Yes, yes, I'm gonna make that. Okay, definitely, definitely. Yeah, there's a box over here. There bo there's a lot of boxes in this area, so I can find them. I got a, a dark matter. Man, this this song is just so beautiful. I love the end of the world music. It, it's, I, I, like, I know I mentioned that before, but it's just so, it's so, like, it's so soothing and mysterious, and it's wonderful. And, ah, damn it, there's, you know, and there's dark balls and invisibles and holy shit. Okay, use, the, use your gravity, Donald. Sora. I don't know what the frick is going. Ow! What the hell? Okay, wait, wait, use it again. Use it again. Okay, I got a dark ball. Okay, both of my teammates are dead. Fucking wonderful. Damn it. Alright, alright. God. Oh. oh, come on! They're doing that Pac-Man shit on me, and it's... I'm losing, like, so much health. I can't even get a combo in. Fucking, I swear to God. Okay, come on. I need this one to fall over. Please. Okay, there we go. I got a Gale from him. Cool. Cool, I got a Gale. I don't know what the hell a Gale is, but okay. Oh, 
I want to be a. I, I swear to God, I want to be an Italian singer. I want to be a freaking. I, I did. I can't sing Latin, by the way, but like you know, I just want to be a freaking Italian singer. If that's a career, I want to be a freaking Italian singer. I'd have such a beautiful voice. And this choir is of nothingness. Okay, was there nothing down here aside from just battle? I don't even know where the hell to go. Am I just stuck? Oh, okay. Uh, I was about to say, am I just stuck here? Okay, but if I do actually go over here, I can get this. Donald got the Meteor Strike, which is a new staff. It doesn't really matter. There's a chest over there. I'm probably not going to get all the goddamn chests, obviously, because half of these chests are... Oh, maybe I will. I I'll, I'll probably go for all these chests, um, or at least as many as I can find. Um, I tell which is all of them, because, you know, I'm, I'm a treasure hunter whenever I play these games. Like, whenever I play these RPGs, I just tend to go after everything I see. Everything in my sight, I just tend to get. Alright, so what's in this box? I got Drill G. Cool. I don't care. I do not. I could honestly care less about gummy pieces. Okay. I'm just looking around. Looking around, scanning my eyeballs in case if I missed anything. I probably missed, like, a lot of shit. I don't know. Because, like, again, these rooms are really, like, despite this, like, this, these rooms are, like, really giant. Like, they are huge, in fact. But they do, they're not big enough to get lost in, honestly. They're actually pretty easy. Okay, Ultima G. Obviously, that's uh, Ultima Gummy. Let's go down here. Let's just fly around. I'm glad I have Glide. Imagine going through here with no Glide. That'd be annoying. Okay. I'm supposed to go over there, but, and yeah, there are bottom sections. Okay, I'm looking around, looking around, scanning my eyeballs in case if I missed any chests. I'm probably going to go over here. Man, again, I, like, oh my god. I, I literally can fall asleep to this music. It is that gorgeous and peaceful that I can fall asleep. There's a save point right there. There's a chest over here. And yeah, that is that is the bottom. There's no bottomless pits in this game. I know there's a mo full life G. What, can that just restore all my HP? Uh, like, is that, uh, can that just honestly restore all my HP when I lose it? That'd be freaking awesome, honestly. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and save, and then we're gonna jump into that, uh, portal, obviously, to the next area. We're 28 hours in, jeez. I know that's just because, you know, I'm going after 100% also. This is a 100% run. Obviously, I could complete this game in, like, 15 hours, obviously, not 15 minutes. So that'd be impressive. Me completing Kingdom Hearts in 15 minutes. That'd be fucking awesome. So this is basically the term the terminals to different parts of you know the worlds obviously so throughout this journey you basically go into these portals and we end up in previous locations that we visited so like here we're in uh traverse town obviously and we're facing all the traverse town uh what is it heartless like the soldiers and shit like that again i know it's kind of a little bit lazy that they didn't just make new rooms but I really like that idea of, like, revisiting your old locations, honestly. Obviously, this game has enough backtracking as it is. That's the problem. And people complain, oh, in Chain of Memories, you backtrack all the damn time. Alright, sit this big bubba down. We got all level 3 magic, so, like, these guys are no problem. Yeah, take the hit, Donald. Just take the hit. All right, I mean, just, uh, nice, nice teamwork. Okay, he's gonna charge. Oh, never mind. I thought he was gonna charge at me, but apparently uh, Goofy stunned him. Okay. I wish there's no air soldiers. <laughs> Not yet. Oh fuck. I think Olympus might be the hardest room to go through. Ow. Okay. What the? Wait. What's going on even? No, 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 no. Okay, Donald died. What's new now? Okay, yeah, these big bubbas used to do so uh, used to be so difficult, but today, nah. Okay, never mind. I was gonna cast Fire Raga on them so I could kill them, but nah, not that's not the case. I got a spirit shard. Wait, what the hell? Oh, he despawned for a second. That was weird. Now, it is optional to revisit these areas. Obviously, you do not have to come back to these areas. I do prefer to just because of the fact that there are treasure chests located in these areas. And also, you'll, you, yeah, I got a spirit gem here. 
Look at that, it's the Lady and the Tramp. That's cool. Um, but also, I typically tend to come back to these areas just because, you know, I do need more, uh, shit. I do need more, uh, what is it? Stuff. Uh, I do need more XP, obviously, so I can level up my character. So in Wonderland, we face off against all the, uh, Nocturnes. There's wizards here. All the magic-based people, obviously. Oh, thank you, Donald. You gave me, uh, Arioga. How kind of you. Now I'll be able to kill these bitches. Okay. Uh, I got a bright shark. I got an ether. I have a lot of ethers, by the way. <laughs> I have, like, ethers up the goddamn ass. Alright. Oh, come on. I could just run right into you. Man, is this, like, not the most epic battle ever? Alright. Green Requiems. Green Requiems and, uh, Wizards and, uh, crap like that. Alright. Oh, okay, we got him. Nice. I was wondering what you guys were doing, but you got the wizard. Thank you for actually being of use. I got a Thunder Gem here. Obviously, these synthesized items don't really matter because, like, I already have, like, so many of these items. So, it's not really gonna matter. But, I, hey, at least you do get more of them, which is handy. Oh, boy. The fucking air soldiers are here. These sons of bitches caused me so much trouble throughout this goddamn journey. I'm just so over you guys. I'm so over you guys. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. Hey, hey. And I know it's kind of bleak to see. I'm so overseeing, you know, Olympus because we came here in the last freaking episode. We came here like so many goddamn times. I'd never want to see Olympus again. Well, that's a goddamn lie because we're gonna see it. We're gonna see it in like Kingdom Hearts 2 and everything. In Kingdom Hearts 2 and Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories and pretty much every single goddamn cage game, pretty much. It even came back in 3 and I'm like, I was just like, I'm so over Olympus. I don't care if it was like, I, I like the, the, the idea that, you know, Olympus had in Kingdom Hearts 3, but I was just like, I'm so over Olympus, I swear to God. Oh my God! Donald got a, a HP at least. No, no, oh, I didn't, <laughs> I didn't mean to cast Kiraga on myself. I meant to, uh, what is it, gravity, but I was just like, nah, I, I want to attack, but I didn't know my, th my thumb was still on L1, which was a problem. Alright. Hey, hey! Back off! Ow! Sora, please slide dash. Oh, cool, I, uh, counterattacked. God, ow! <laughs> I hate these air soldiers so much! I hate them! God damn it! Okay. He did drop a high potion, which is handy, I guess. I guess. I mean, I might as well take him. Alright. Let this wyvern out of here. This wyvern out of here. Any day now. Okay, there we go. It's not really gonna matter because there's only two of them left. And I don't want to cast a Gravaga because I don't want to waste my, you know, I don't want to waste my uh, blocks. Okay, did we did we get them all? Like, yeah, okay, we got them all. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, so now we can get the. There's not a box back here. I thought there was. We could get the box over here. I yeah, over here, underneath his freaking legs. Which, honestly, looks disgusting. We got a Frost Gem. That's kind of helpful, I guess. Uh, frost Gems come from the Search Ghost, so, yeah. Okay. I'm pretty sure in, like, the final room, we're gonna get something pretty rare. I wonder if my name is up here still. I, 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 I like, find all these cups. I wonder if my name is still up there. Because your name can actually be up there if you win the cups, and I did. I won all the cups, so my name was up there. Alrighty, then. Oh look, deep jungle! Yay! The freaking monkeys are here. Wonderful. I'm gonna miss these damn monkeys. The goddamn monkeys were fun. They were they were a blast to fight. Because the monkeys are actually one of uh, some of my favorite heartless. Uh, I really love the monkeys. They're fun to fight, and they're also you know I I just love their design too. At least. I do enjoy, I do like how they looked in Kingdom Hearts 1, how they were actually, they didn't have bright colors, they were dark colored. 
but, you know, there's still, I'm still gonna goddamn this Deep Jungle. Deep Jungle has still yet to return in a Kingdom Hearts game. And I know exactly why, because, you know, the Edgar Rice Burroughs just refused to put Tarzan back. But, I, I, I will not sleep until, you know, the monkeys come back. Oh, these fuckers. Look at them go flying. Alright. They do drop bananas. Yep, they dropped a banana and I lost all my mana. But banana mana. Banana mana. What the hell is going on? Okay. Hey, hey, hey stop slingshotting. Stop slingshotting. Did the music just restart? <laughs> I, like, I got out of view that it just restarted. Alrighty, well. Stop it. It's monkey time. Stop monkeying around. Ah, oh, all the monkeys, huh? Alright, I wish I got the other one. You know, come to question, do Heartless have genders? I, like, I don't know if that's ever been answered. Do the Heartless actually have genders? Because you notice how, like, um, the pink one, the pink monkeys, uh, actually look very girly-like. So, are they actually girls? Are we just beating up girls for no reason? Ow. Okay, what the hell? But no, 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 not the box. Where the, okay. Oh, God, he despawned. Oh, he despawned, okay. Uh, I was like, oh, did he disappear? Nah, I, I, I thought he was gonna respawn, he didn't. Okay, got a bright gem. It's kinda handy. All right, I'm doing pretty good. We're doing pretty good. We still got a couple more levels to go through. I think we still have like, we still have Agrabah, I know. We still have like, yep, here we are in Agrabah. We still have Agrabah to go through. We still got like freaking. Uh, always the good news is that Agrabah's one big room. It's not, you know, it's not anything else. Right, get the bandits out of here. Donald, I don't know what you're doing. You're probably sucking ass. Well, pause, not, you know, literally. All right, there's a box down here. Let me get the box! Let me, fuck, get the fucking box. Okay, I got a blaze jump. All right, yeah, let's send him flying. Let's send him flying to orbit. All right. We can't go in the storage room, sadly. Like, we, I wish we could, but we can't go in the storage room, which is kind of unfortunate. All right. Man, it's so beautiful. Such beautiful music. Is there anything up here or no? Did I just waste my time? Yeah, I just wasted my time. Thought there was something up there, but no, of course not. There would never ever be something up there. We can't even go to we can't even go say hi to Aladdin or Kurt Zisa or anybody. They've blocked off like every room. I mean I could still like explore this area, like I can still do that. Oh 2K20 is ready to use. Cool! I don't want to play 2K20. If you guys are wondering why I'm playing 2K20, my friends are playing it and you know we're playing basketball and shit like that. And I fucking hate it because I don't like playing basketball. It's fucking boring. Hold down. Come on. Oh, did he just spit out health? Wait, if you tech um uh, uh fat bandits, they spit out health? I never knew that. That's interesting. I actually did not know that. That is so cool. Alrighty then. I'll face y'all bandits. I'll face the fat ba the. I'll face these bandits. Good job, Donald. Sucks that we can't go in the palace in this game. Uh, I wish I could go in the goddamn palace in this game, but no, you can't, which is unfortunate. At least there's no pot centipede, thank fucking god. Imagine if the pot centipede returned, how pissed I would be. Alright, I got a blaze gem. Uh, that's pretty much it. There was just blaze gems in this area. I already got a lot of blaze gems, so it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I'm just kidding, I love this song. <laughs> oh man. We're going through every level. Oh god damn it, of course it's Atlantica. Of course we're in fucking Atlantica. Everyone's least favorite stage in the goddamn world. You know what? I'm, I'm so over this level. I'm so I'm so over goddamn Atlantica. This level sucks. It sucks the fucking pee pee. It's, it's terrible. Atlantica's horrible. I never want to see this level again. At least it gave me a lot of MP bubbles and shit like that. The Atlantica level was probably like the most roughest. Um, it was probably like the most roughest. Uh, what is it? Uh, 
Uh, it was probably like the most roughest episode we went through, aside from Hollow Bastion. Hollow Bastion was also extremely rough, especially with the fucking dragon. Seriously, fuck that dragon. Dragon Maleficent is horrible. And for the people who are like, oh, I beat Dragon Maleficent first try, you suck, Cloud. No! He's hard! She's hard! Pause! Mega pause on that. God damn it. I'm still curious as to, like, what the pause compilation is going to be for this. It's going to be a big, massive one. Okay, hold on, hold on. These fishes are giant. There's always a bigger fish, like Qui-Gon Jinn says. Oh, that's right, he's not going to do annoying shit, because I got gravity. I got Gravaga. If I did not have Gravaga, I would be losing my mind here. Okay, no, I need that. There's a box. There's a big box down here. What do we got? A mega potion. Uh, I only have high potions and ethers equipped. I probably should equip mega potions. I don't know. I probably should. Okay, I got an AP up. Uh, do I need shit? Uh, I, I, I could get another treasure magnet, maybe, or a tech boost. I probably could equip another tech boost. I thought that would be I don't know. I don't know. I'll probably get myself another tech boost, probably. Probably, probably, probably. Uh, AP ups. Use on myself. Fuck my teammates. Don't, not literally, but seriously, I don't need, I don't need their assistance. Alright, there we go. Tech boost on that. Let's just get out of Atlantica because I never want to go to this freaking level again. Oh, my phone just went off. Uh. Alright. So I had to send a quick text. Somebody was freaking texting me and that honestly was distracting. Oh, look, we're in Halloween Town. Sweet. I actually like Halloween Town. It's Oogie Boogie's little freaking uh, slot machine of hell and death. Because, you know, this was... Uh, honestly, it was kind of an annoying. Well, at least we get to see the grainy texture again. Because I really love the grainy texture of uh, uh, this. Of the stage. Okay. Uh, fuck, fuck, fuck. God damn it. Okay. Ah, oh, shit. Uh, he disappeared. Let's go fight him. I'm a badass now. I, I'm i so freaking badass. I'm so happy. Alright, I am so freaking badass. You can't deny it. Like, I leveled up my character so freaking much. Like, I am such a bad... I'm just, I'm just too good, honestly. Alright. The White Knights are... I really do like the White Knights because, like, it's easy to tech them and it's easy to counter, uh, counter guard them. So it is handy, honestly. God damn it. Stop moving! It's just that they move a lot. Okay, wait. Uh... Let's see. Come on, knock him down, knock him down, knock him down. Yeah! Okay, what the hell? Okay, let's get him, let's get him, let's get him. Alright. Ah, uh, fuck. We got the gargoyles. We got the gargoyles here. They always sound weird. They sound really funky, honestly. Just... And yeah, Donald is casting Thundaga and it is, do it is doing devastating attacks. I wish I could cast Thundaga myself, but I'd rather have Gravaga. Because Gravaga is very helpful, actually. I thought I was going to use Thunder like a lot more, but nah. Gravity, gravity just uh, wins it all. And Gravity becomes useless after Kingdom Hearts 1, sadly. Alright, we got a Lucid Gem here. I didn't get any boxes, so it's actually nice that they gave me a Lucid Gem. Cameron's about to die. Alright, we just reset it. Eight. Uh, let's go ahead and head to the next level, which I think is Neverland, correct? Yep, we're in Neverland. Yay! Oh, I can't fly in this area. I thought I could. I can't fly in this uh, version of Neverland, sadly. They don't give me the satisfaction. You're like, ew, you're in End of the World. You're not cool enough to fly in Neverland. Oh boy, and they lock me in. Alright, we got a, 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 a spider, a, 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 bear, a, a, a barrel spider, whatever it's called. Donald died. I don't know where Goofy is. He's probably eating Cheerios. Oh, there he is. Never mind. I was about to say, is Don uh, Goofy just eating Cheerios somewhere else? Alright. But we can go in over here. Yeah, now we can go in this room. Is there any okay, we can get this box over here. Um, we can't explore all of Neverland, sadly. Okay, Goofy did also get the Mighty Shield, um, so that's another weapon that he can use. Not like it really matters, because, you know... Honestly, uh, like, at this, like, nobody needs to, like, I've gone default weapon the whole game. I've not switched my Keyblade. 
The only times I did switch my Keyblade was when I was doing the Sora only um, cups, obviously. Oh, fucking wonderful. We're in the, the fucking 100 acre woods. God damn it, I hate this area. At least it gave me a Mega Elixir. Thank God. At least you could just go in and get a Mega Elixir. Fuck the 100 acre woods. Okay, shit. So this giant flame, we're actually in Hollow Bastion, but it's not really Hollow Bastion. It's actually some other, like, unseen corridor in Hollow Bastion or something like that. I am convinced that maybe this was an unused room in Hollow Bastion and they just used it uh, for End of the World. They were just like, ah, oh, shit. We might as well just use this for End of the World, obviously. Okay, these guys are kicking our asses. Gravity. Gravaga is so helpful, honestly. It's got such good range and it's... You know, it does devastating attacks. Hoopa got max AP. Cool. Ow. Alright. It's kind of... <laughs> it's kind of silly that the freaking Heartless logo is just floating in the air over here. Like, for no unexplained reason. It's just floating. And get your ass up, Donald. Alright, but Goofy got max AP, so, uh, I can get him MP Rage or MP Haste. I'll probably give him MP Haste, because he's already got MP Rage. Um... And I, 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 yeah, yeah, okay, that, there we go, okay. Uh, wait, where are we? World Terminus, that's what this area is called. What's my status? Okay, I need a little bit more, and then I'm gonna be leveled up. Obviously, I'll be leveled up to level 60. Okay, we can get this box. Got an elixir. Uh, and then we're supposed to read this. One's born of the heart and darkness, devoid of hearts, ravage all worlds, and bring des uh, uh, desolation. Uh, uh. Desolution. Seize all hearts and consummate the great heart. All hearts to be one, one heart, encompass all. God, if I took a shot every time they said heart, I'd probably be dead by now. Realize the destiny, the realm of kingdom hearts, the great darkness sealed within the great heart. Uh, pr uh, our progeny of darkness come back to the eternal darkness, for the heart of light shall unseal the path. Seven hearts, one keyhole, one key to the door. The door of darkness tied by two keys. Pause. Obviously, probably double pause. Uh, the door of darkness to seal the light. None shall uh, pass, but shadows returning to the darkness. One's born of the heart and darkness. Hunger for every heart until the dark door opens. I don't exactly know what the fuck that means, but it's probably shit we already knew. Which is obviously that, like, you know, we have to go seal Kingdom Hearts so that all this shit ends. So that this nightmare ends. So that this journey ends, pretty much. That, I think that's the best way I could sum it up. I seriously have no idea what that means. I I've been playing this game since, like, 2007, and I still don't know. We can't go in these black holes, sadly. They're just floating here for no reason. Okay, but the Heartless logo, I think, is gone now. Uh, no, it's not. What the hell? I think we could just leave. We could just leave. Whoosh! Going in the black hole. Alrighty, then. Unless if I was supposed to do something else, which probably not. Okay, so... In this area, we can go in here. Oh, wait. Oh, shit. I'm going backwards. I'm going backwards. Oh, there is a save point, so... I might as well save. I didn't know there was actually a save point here. I didn't see that at first. Probably because everything's green, and green's so putrid, and it looks disgusting. So I need to go back. The Wait, which way? This way, this way. God, I, I got confused. I didn't know which way I was supposed to go. Anyways, so basically, once we jump down here, we have to basically fight our first boss in End of the World, and probably the only boss in this episode. What the fuck? What the hell? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh oh! <laughs> ah! No! Death is coming! <laughs> oh boy. Alright. So, this is the boss against Sharonabog. And Sharonabog is a really hard bastard. It's, it's kind of like the uh, dragon, uh, uh, the giant Ursula fight. Uh, but basically, we're flying the whole round and we just gotta do damage to him as he's bringing up, you know, fire and shit and crazy shit like that. God, this fight's gonna be insane, honestly. I mean, it starts off easy, but then it's gonna get fucking hard. I died a few times uh, facing Sharon Abog before. I did it done. Dumb. I do really enjoy how the, uh, how the battle music is A Night on Bald Mountain, which is uh, a fantastically composed song. It's one of my favorite songs. Uh, one of my favorite uh, uh, songs in, in like musical history. Um, they made this for Fantasia, and my fucking god, it's, it kicks ass. 
it's such a great, uh, what is it, orchestral, play yeah, orchestral piece. Alright, we got I mean, since I took down Dragon Maleficent, uh, not Dragon Maleficent, Dragon Earth, uh, not, I, oh, God, I fucking got my bosses confused. Since I took down, uh, what is it, um, uh, 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 Giant Ursula first try. I think I will be okay. I shouldn't jinx anything because, you know, who knows? This guy might kick my ass. He might kick my ass. Alright. Alright, just gotta keep doing damage. Oh shit. Oh shit. He's bringing out the big flames. And Donald is dead because, you know, fuck it. He's an idiot. Okay, come here, you. Come here! Stop moving! Oh god damn it. Oh god damn it. Oh shit! Okay, well, thank god I had Leaf Bracer, otherwise I would have been dead there. Alright. Alright. Well, god, this is gonna go. This is going rough a little bit, but don't worry, I have more health than I think. Just so long as I don't do anything idiotic, like accidentally ki getting myself killed. Oh, thanks, Donald. Uh, I mean, Goofy. Alright, slap that on. Thanks, Donald, you healed me. I was, I was gonna ask when you were gonna heal me. Ariel very helpful because I can ha I can basically halve damage uh, when he does attacks like that. Ow. Okay. Might have to heal myself in a goddamn second. Alright. Oh shit! Oh shit! Run! Ah! God. Oh my god. Oh man. Oh man. Oh, what the hell? What's oh, okay. He's gonna blast me back. Oh man. I'm so glad I have second chance, but at the same time, like... Oh man, it, it's so easy. Like I can get killed uh, if I do something stupid, and I don't wanna. All right, but we're, we almost got him. We almost got him. That's a lie. He still has like so much health. Oh fuck! Oh shit! Oh shit! Run! 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 Fucking run! Holy shit! Oh man, Donald. I don't even know what the hell Donald's doing. Oh, what the? Where am I? Okay. I can only go in for a few licks, honestly. That's all I can do. Oh shit, he's gonna do the big blast. Oh boy, ow. Oh, thanks, Donald. <laughs> Donald healed me right as he died. What a champ. What a champ. Okay. I think shit's gonna get way more insane. Uh, because he's, uh, I think he's in his third and final phase. I can't exactly remember. Oh, what the hell? Oh, what the hell? Oh shit. He's gonna bring out the magnet moves. These things do- Oh, God. Oh, God. Run, 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 run. <laughs> run. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. Oh, boy. Man. Oh, thanks, Goofy. Okay, you gave me an MP gift. I'll let me heal, just so I don't die. Oh, boy. He's making a big fireball. Whoa. I actually went to the music right there. Ow. Okay. I attacked 270. I don't even know how. Okay. No. Oh, shit. He's gonna- Big flame. Big flame. Okay. I, I honestly should just do little attacks. I should not be bum rushing like what I'm doing. But at the same time, he has like so little health. Like, I could probably do it. I can maybe do it. God, I don't want to be right underneath his armpit. Oh, god damn it. Run, 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 run! Oh, boy. Oh, man. Okay, there we go. There we go. I might be able to one shot. Oh shit! I should not jinx anything. I might be able to one shot. Uh, what is it? Uh, uh, I might be able to do that. Oh my god! Oh my lord! I might be able to one shot. Uh, what is it? Sharon of Og, but I don't want to jinx anything. I don't want to jinx anything. I'm taking a lot of damage. Donald, your job in life is just to heal. That's all it is at this point. Just heal when I am about to die. All right, come on, come on, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, Donald's got a block, but it ain't gonna matter. We got two blocks. Okay, whoa, run back, run back. <laughs> That's actually, oh shit, ow. That's actually pretty badass that how I'm just like flying away from him, just causing doomsday in hell. I mean, this is the fucking devil. Like this boss is literally the go oh my lord. This boss is literally the goddamn devil. Oh, I don't even know what the hell I'm doing. I can't see. I can't. Oh, no. where am I going? Wait. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. I don't know what happened. I just and I just fell for no reason. Donald's still hanging dead. Hang loose, Donald. Okay. 
Okay. Let me go in. Let me get my licks. Let me get my licks. Pause. Take a pause. I don't know. I, I can't really make jokes. <laughs> I'm like so focused as to what's going on. Oh my god. Doing this no armor, by the way. Kingdom Key only no armor. Which I did like a year ago. Uh, when I had to do that. That was fucking insane. That was like so hard. Especially this fight. I had to fight this guy. Because there was no save point after this. Oh my god. I probably should save after this fight. Oh my god, oh god, retreat, 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 we're fucking treat. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. God oh, okay. I have a block. I have a block. And I have very little health. And I got my items too, in case I need them. But he's really close. He's really close to death. Okay, run back, run. Oh, no! Oh shit! Oh fuck. Oh my god. I almost died. That actually was really scary. Oh man. Okay. Let him charge up his fireballs. I don't really care. God damn it. Where the hell's. Okay. Okay, thank you. I'm going for it. I okay, never mind. Never mind. I should I shouldn't have gone for it. Okay. I'm going for it! I'm going for it! He's one! He's one HP! He's one HP! Watch this! I'm gonna throw a giant fireball at his face! Giant fireball! Oh, okay, wait, 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 let me get closer. BAM! <laughs> right in your fucking face! <laughs> I just threw a giant fireball at the devil's face! Holy shit! <laughs> oh man, that was- <laughs> I'm so giddy after that! Boosh! Oh man, I am a badass! To hell you go, you fucking devil. To hell you fucking go. Holy shit. And now we learn the shared ability super glide, which basically allows me to glide uh, faster than I normally uh, did before. So, I also got Blitz, too. So, I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna equip Blitz. Yeah, let me just turn off Deck Boost, because I already have two of them. Equip Blitz. Yeah, okay. So Blitz basically allows me that I can, you know, as my third hit, I can basically do a more powerful finish. So, that's handy. Donald, Goofy, you didn't get anything. I got eight MP blocks now, so I have a lot of MP. I have, like, a lot of it. Alrighty then. So now, with, uh, oh yeah, I forgot. I need to put on Super Glide, because if I don't, I'll be mad. So basically, while holding square, I'll be able to glide way faster, which will be way more helpful. So now I can basically go down here to where the devil was. And, uh, we can now exit, honestly. Well, we're still flying. We can't, like, freaking stand on anything. Oh, man. What the hell? What are these st- Uh, what are these strands? Is this what the devil's- The, the devil been shitting? What, shared a block been shitting? These are his shit stains? Oh, that's nasty. The fuck? <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, what the hell? I don't even know where I'm going. Okay, I need to go down here. What? Let me go down here. God, it's so hard to control, like, when you're flying and stuff. What the hell? There's a lot of... There's a lot of, like, painting-like stuff, but these are really, like, structures. That's weird. What's going on? These are a lot of broken structures and stuff like that. Alright, anyways. So we're about to approach probably the final and the most difficult room in the game. In this final room, you had to face off against so many waves of different heartless. So obviously here, we're facing off against sh uh, um, yeah, that was Blitz, by the way. Here, we're basically facing off against Behemoth for the last and final fucking time. Meanwhile, Donald and I are just ripping through him with, uh, what is it, gravity. Alrighty then. Okay, I don't really want to do Shock Blast, because Shock Blast isn't really doing anything. Okay, but anyways, like I was saying, in this final room, uh, basically, it, this is like, we have to face off against numerous of different Heartless in order to get to the last room in the game so we can get to the final save point. But before that, you know, we have to face off against some of, like, the most imp <coughs> some of the, like, the most infamously difficult Heartless in the game. This is, like, one of the most infamous rooms in Kingdom Hearts 1. Especially doing this like level one. It's hell honestly. It is absolute hell to go through this room All right, but we almost got uh, behemoth dead 
And when you're doing this, no continues either. Uh, you have to fight Sheridabog again, which is bullshit, honestly. So, like, I died here so many goddamn times when doing the level one no continue run. Uh, and I just, I, like, couldn't stand it, especially no armor. I, like, was raging my ass off so hard, honestly. Alrighty then. But... I shouldn't get too giddy because we're almost we're almost at the end at this point. We're almost this is like the home stretch, honestly. Okay, 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 okay. Oh boy. Let me just blast you more. We're almost we almost got him. We almost got him. All right. I think he's gonna die on this one. Yes, he did. Sweet. Awesome. He dropped no rewards for us, just uh, a whole bunch of nothingness. So, anyways, with that being said, because we beat one boss. We got one fragment off the door. We need to get like at least four more. So now the second phase, we got dark balls and other crazy bullshit like that. Yeah, it's just a whole bunch of dark balls. Dark balls, dark balls, dark balls. I fucking hate dark balls. Cause they, they honestly just, they're, they're so annoying. Honestly, they're, they're annoying to move. They're do the Pac-Man shit all the time. Okay, Donald learned second chance. And we got invisibles too. Holy shit. Oh, wow. Wow. Can I cast gravity, please? Okay. Got... No. I need to... Yes. There we go. Okay. I need to cast gravity, like, on all of these guys. Damn it. Oh, shit. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. All right. Come on, kill him. Okay. Hallelujah. In the sanctuary. What the hell is happening? <laughs> Alright, then. I also got- Oh, cool. I got a- I got a Gale. Cool. I got a Gale. I don't know what the fuck a Gale is, but I got one. I, I got it. Well, I know it's a synthesis item, but I don't know what a Gale is. I don't know what it looks like. I don't know what it does. It, it, it's just in the game. Fuck. Whoa. Hey. Okay. Gravity, gravity, gravity. Okay. Yes! We got them both. Yes! Yes, thank you. Give me more MP, Goofy. That's your role in life. Just give me MP. Okay, okay. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah! Alright, shock them. The fucking angels! The fucking angel stars, man! Right, come on. Oh, bitch. Okay. Ow. Yeah, rain hell on him, Goofy. Rain hell. I don't know. Just rain hell. Do something. I don't know. Okay. All right. Come on. Come on. Ow. God. Oh, shit. Yeah, nice up. I want to. I want to attack him. Okay. I'm not gonna heal yet. I probably should. So, oh, now I should. Holy fuck. Almost died again. I am cheating death like nobody's business. Okay. No, don't fucking move. Okay. I, I teched him? I don't know how I did that, but I did. I apparently teched one of the angel stars. Okay. Uh, you're low health. I'll go for you. Got, okay, never mind. Man, this is just... This is fucking epic. Again, I know my commentary sucks because I'm focusing, like, really hard. Ah! Oh! Whoa! 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 Whoa there! Whoa! Oh. I don't know who to target and where to- Ow! Stop! Oh my shit! He's just coming at me! Wait, what the- Wait, what? Uh, I can't grab him! Uh, wait. God damn it. Okay, go, 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 go! Shit! That didn't work! Ah! Uh, I'm stressing out! Oh, I'm stressing out! Oh, I'm stressing out! Holy shit! Oh, man. Oh, man. I'm getting stressed. Oh, fuck. Oh, I'm, I'm losing it. I'm losing it. I'm like, freaking losing it. Okay, hold on. Hold on. I don't wanna... I don't wanna lose my focus yet. Oh, my lord. Oh, my lord. Okay, I got more MP. I got more health. Okay, my teammates are a dominator right now. Okay, what the... What the hell is going on? Okay, there we go. 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 Ow. How is this angel star still here? Oh, there's two of them. Fucking wonderful. Okay. 
Ow. Gravity him, gravity him. Okay. Oh, I got both of them. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. That, like, never happens. There's still so many goddamn enemies in this area. Okay, okay. Hold on, hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I don't want to go for him, but okay. I guess we will. Ah! Dang, nab it, dang it! Stop moving! Stop it! Damn you to hell! I got another Gale! Alright, come on, come on. Uh, shock him. Go. Yes. We got an ether. There's one over there. There's so many goddamn. Oh man, there's so many goddamn angel stars. It's insane. Alright, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, damn it. Alright, come on. Don't, don't lose it now. Okay. We're doing really good. Well, I. Fuck, I shouldn't have changed that effect. Oh, please, Donald gave me uh, Arioga. I completely forgot I even had Arioga. I probably should have used it. Okay. Now we have the last little bits of uh, enemies here. Oh, come on. He's going to go invisible. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Brain has all faster, faster. Okay, what the hell am I even What am I even hitting? Okay, come on, come on. Bring it down. Bring it down. Yes. Okay. Ow. That's that's the mojo. That's the mojo that we're doing. We're just using Ravaga. I probably should use uh Ow. Okay, he's gonna disappear. Let's go for this angel star. Ow. I'm sorry, Grading, I don't care! It's not really doing too much damage, sadly. But I don't care, I'm invincible on this He's like so low health. Okay. Thank you, Donald. We kind of knew that I was about to die. Ah! Stop moving! There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay, come on. Ow! Stop shooting that freaking lightning thing at me. I don't even know what it is. Oh, orbs of like, uh, electricity or something. Ow. Okay, but I think this is the last invisible. I can't exactly remember. I think it is. Because there's no way they would throw another wave at me. That would just be evil. Come on. This is I, Yeah, I think that's the last one. Is that the last one? There's fucking more. God! Okay. Oh, man, I'm sorry. I get my commentary sucks so hard. Okay, just put fucking. I don't care. Just put it on. Just put on the Arioga. I I literally could care less. Okay. Yeah, that's right. I, I I can't. I get I get inflict faster damage on you. Oh fuck. I don't know how much longer I can go. This is evil. All right, but my health is doing fine. My health is doing fine, at least. That's the good news. Alright, come on. R.I.P. R.I.P. Come on, R.I.P. Oh, come on. Stop guarding, you fuck. There we go, R.I.P. Uh, there's this guy. Bring him down, bring him down. Alright, is that it? That had to be the last one. Please. Yes! That was the last wave. Holy shit. That took forever. But we did it. So the last piece is unlocked. We can now go in to the final room in the game. Obviously. God damn it. That was fucking rough. Goofy needs a little bit more and then he'll level up. And of course, Sora a little bit more and then he'll level up too. Uh, Donald needs like a lot and he'll level up. Okay. Well, anyways. Now we're going to go through to this room. And this is the final rest in the game. Right there is the final door. I'm just going to activate it to show off what exactly it is. Right now, this is the last chest. It gives me one last mega elixir. So I'm going to act. I want to show, show what this is. Huh? What's wrong? Don't you hear something? There. Careful. This is the last haven you'll find here. Beyond, there is no light to protect you. But don't be afraid. Your heart is the mightiest weapon of all. Remember, you are the one who will open the door to light. I don't hear anything. Strange. That voice was so familiar. Maybe it's just my imagination. Maybe you'd better take a rest. 
So basically what this means is that once we step through this door, if I hit the triangle button, which I'm not gonna do right now, but once we step through this door, that ensures the final battle in the game. We will not be able to come back and save. We'll not be able to come back to any previous worlds. We'll be able to do nothing more because beyond that, it's just the final battle between Ansem and that's it. So this is pretty much the point of no return. So I'm just gonna save here and I'm gonna wrap up the episode of End of the World, obviously, because we went through the whole level. We, we pretty much completed the entire level up to this point. Uh, the only thing that we have left is obviously to fight um, Ansem, obviously. I'm gonna get to level 69 just because <laughs> you all know what happens after the adventure. <laughs> no, but I I'm just kidding. I'll get to like maybe level 68 because I think I'm gonna level up one more time uh, when I fight one of the Ansem fights. And that will be, well, that will pretty much be it. Maybe level 67 just so I can secure that. Because I don't want to accidentally level up to level 70 and then cause the whole Let's Play to be ruined. So, I'll probably get to level 69 and then we'll just pretty much finish the game from then on. Uh, in the meantime, if you guys are looking forward to the next episode of Kingdom Hearts Final Mix, it's going to be a while. I Okay, I have a lot to do in the meantime. I have like a lot of other recordings to do. Uh, obviously, you know, um, I have a lot of other plans and I will need to sit down and find time to play Kingdom Hearts Final Mix again so I can do the rest of the synthesis stuff and I can also get the ultimate weapon so I can do all the post-game uh, bosses because I'm not fighting them Kingdom Key only. I am not gonna go fight any of these post-game bosses Kingdom Key only because that's gonna be fucking insane. It's gonna be hard. So I'm not going to do that. Instead, I'm just going to go. I'm going to grind a little bit more. And uh, then, yeah, we'll, we'll we'll finish this game once and for all. So, it, it, you know, it, it, I don't want to conclude anything right now. But as of now, this is it for Kingdom Hearts Final Mix. I will not be playing this game for a while. Expect maybe like a couple of weeks off from this game. So, I don't know. Maybe I'll already finish that recording. Like, I'll finish the gold match recording by the time you guys are gonna see that. Um, and, that and then I'll, I'll go ahead and do the final battle. Or if you're watching for the future, you know, you got all the episodes right there. So you can just click onto the next video and you know, all that jazz happens. But this is it for Kingdom Hearts Final Mix right now. And my concluding thoughts. This was a really fun endeavor, obviously. I want to, like, I don't want to make any final criticisms right now. I'm, I'm obviously going to say it all in the battle report. Uh, I'll let the credits roll by just without my commentary and my face and everything. You guys can see, like, the finale and everything. Just not with me, obviously. Because I want you guys to experience the ending fresh. I, I don't want to put my own commentary or my own spice on it. I'm just going to sit here, I'm going to watch it, and that will pretty much be it. In the final battle, well, obviously, there will be a separate episode for, like, the ending and the credits and that stuff. That's just not going to be with my commentary. It's just going to be the gameplay and the gameplay only. But the final battle will be it for me. But after the credits, I'll give my final thoughts of Kingdom Hearts Final Mix. But right now, I just want to say that this was a really fun endeavor to go through. This was a, a fantastic journey. Obviously, like, just, like, I really enjoyed playing this game again. Like, what I love about Kingdom Hearts 1 is just how magical this game is. Like, it really feels like an old-school Disney movie, but at the same time, like, a really, really awesome and fresh adventure. And the best part about Kingdom Hearts 1 is just this unknown factor. This factor of just going into this game and not knowing anything. It's like, yes, it is a little confusing. There is definitely a lot of riddles. There's a lot of, like, unexplained lore and shit like that that obviously people put together. And, you know, despite the memes, despite, like, the convoluted story, despite all that shit like that, the original Kingdom Hearts 1 base alone, like, just this game alone is amazing like it is such a compelling story to tell one's uh, to tell a hero's journey and i love that so very much i loved how this game told the hero's journey so so very much it's a little confusing but it's not really so confusing in fact it's actually the best story in the entire entire series in my opinion i like how the future games up the stakes a little bit but i will admit it doesn't really hold the same level of groundedness like Kingdom Hearts 1. Kingdom Hearts 1 is so good in terms of groundedness. And I know I paused a lot throughout this game to explain like the story. I joked around on the story a little bit, but you know, it's just such a joy to go through. And I love it. I love it a lot. Um, 
And graphically, this game, you know, this is obviously the HD remix of the game. And I know the animation's dated. And this was like the first of its kind. Like, this was one of the earliest PS2 games ever made. But still, it's so, like, mind-blowingly awesome. And it's so amazing. And it's so well-crafted altogether. And the gameplay is so unique. It's so different. And, and it actually takes a lot of skill. But at the same time, it doesn't feel unfair. The game is hard, don't get me wrong, I know I played on hard mode, and I died a lot of times, like the dragon I think is still, in my opinion, the hardest part about this game. Dragon Maleficent is the hardest aspect, maybe not the, the secret boss is obviously like, you know, Sephiroth is infamous for being the hardest, but I don't think I'm gonna have too much of a struggle on Sephiroth because I fought him numerous of times, and I might be, you know, confident enough to actually fight him, uh, but like, Dragon Maleficent was fucking hard, but I love how this game requires the player to get better with skill. It doesn't spoil the player by giving them a broken and a, you know, redundant factor to the game. It instead requires the player to really sort of think. Like, you have to be quick and you have to be fast to play this game. But at the same time, you can think, you can take things slow, and you can just have a general overall good experience. And there's still a lot of challenge in this game. It is really hard. Like, it's a pretty tough game. And I like that about Kingdom Hearts 1. It doesn't really feel too easy. I mean, as a Kingdom Hearts veteran myself, um, I do find that, you know, playing on standard mode and even, like, you know, easy mode is a, a really, really boring because I think I can just go through the whole game without dying once. But on my first time playing this game, it requires so much skill but it's so goddamn fun, and I adore that with Kingdom Hearts Phonomix. I don't think I'm going to really get too much of that in the later games. Like, when I do Chain of Memories, I'm going to do it hard mode. Chain of Memories isn't really that bad because you just have to get used to the card mechanic gameplay, and that's pretty much it. Uh, and then, like, you know, um, Kingdom Hearts 2, I'm going to be playing that on a critical, which is considered brutal and absolutely ass-rapingly hard. <laughs> so it's really not going to be that great, but I had just so much fun playing on hard mode, and I just, I had a blast going through this game. And I hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough, too. I mean, you guys, you're incredible. Thank you, everybody, for sticking around and watching this series. Um, the whole way, honestly. I know I got the parts out a little bit later compared to what I normally do because I was recording a lot more than I was editing. I was recording all these parts, like, way, way before the final episodes. But, you know, like, by the time you guys are watching this, I'm, like, only, I only released episode 7, which is, you know, kind of, what well, on my time, I released episode 7. But for you guys, this is, like, episode 20, like, 21 or 22, or I don't even know what uh, number it is. <laughs> I lost count. Um, but, you know, I thank you guys so much for joining me on this endeavor. It was a really fun journey. It's not over yet. Don't, it's not the last episode because we still have, like, so much more to do. We still have to do all the super bosses. I'm going to dedicate an episode to every single one of the super bosses. And then the final battle with Ansem. There's going to be one last episode with, like, the credits and, like, you know, the battle report. And I'm going to give my final thoughts on Kingdom Hearts Final Mix properly. But until then, I finished End of the World. And I can conclude that there. So thank you everybody so much for watching. It has been a blast and a joy to play this game. I wholeheartedly loved it. love you guys so much. And I wholeheartedly enjoy this. And god damn it, I went on that spiel for like six, seven minutes. I'm sorry. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy this episode. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel. It helps immensely for a small YouTuber like me. And um, I just thank you guys again for watching. Have yourselves a fantastic night. Stay safe. Wash your hands. Wear a mask if you're planning to go outside. And take care.